guys. My name is Sarah Wells and I am a Wilson High School graduate from the class of 2006. And I was one of the lucky students to be able to take drawing and painting and AP studio art with Mr. Zito while I was there. I was just like the normal students, you know, picking your electives. And art was never a question. That's been important to me since day one. Um, but then when I picked AP studio art and drawing and painting, I got lucky. I got Mr. Zito as my teacher and it was one of the best decisions I could have made. Um, I was a shy student. I stuck to my friend group. I didn't really want to stand out in a crowd. But after taking Mr. Zito's classes, I can honestly say that there was a side of me that, you know, kind of came out, a confidence that grew that I didn't know was there. And um, the class, his classes weren't just classes. Um, they were a place for students of all kinds, all backgrounds, all interests to come together, share their common interest of art, and really become a family. I remember that he was a really good teacher about challenging his students, pushing them past, just putting some brush stroke on a canvas and calling it a painting. He encouraged us to really think about the meaning and what inspired us to get there. Um, why did you put that line there? Why is that background what you did? Why are those colors important to you? He, there, was, there was always um, a, a need to find the why. There was no, well, I just like painting trees. We had to get out of our comfort zones. We had to really share what got us to that image. And I think it created a really strong bond among the students. Hearing each other's stories, um, I think it led to a lot of trust between us because we're really putting ourselves out there. But it, it never felt I mean, I mean, sure, it's scary. Anytime it's scary to share yourself a little bit, but it felt like a safe place. There was no fear of judgment. Um, there was no feeling of, oh, well, my idea is kind of silly or it's not good enough. Um, it, that was never, ever a thought. If it needed more substance, we were never shot down. We were just encouraged. And I think it's a bond that we really all kind of still share. Uh, I mean, 10 years later, some of us are still hanging out and having many reunions when we're in town. So I think that's really special, especially to come from just one singular class um, and not your entire high school um, experience. Just that Because that one class really stood out and you guys, you know, we all created such a strong bond together. Um, you know, there's no doubt in my mind that the art program and Mr. Zito what he brought to it placed a significant impact on my career and the way I look at the world today. Anything is possible with art and you must, you just have to keep an open mind. Um, you can express any emotion, tell any story and it can be for someone else or it can be just for you. Um, you're only limited by your imagination and seeing the variation in all of the students' projects really convinced me that the imagination is limitless. Um, as I said a little earlier, um, the class gave me confidence, confidence to present my ideas without fear, um, without fear of judgment. And I have carried that into the workplace, I think. Um, I'm now a graphic designer and event planner with um, weddings and local festivals. And so creativity is something I rely on every single day. And Mr. Zito's classes have really stuck with me for that. And um, all these years they have, and they, I really think they'll continue to do so. Um, so, side note, Mr. Zito, thank you so much for creating such a memorable experience for us, um, showing us what art can do and uh, what art is. And your classes, um, they were always a period during the day that I look forward to every time. And I'm just really grateful for the experience. So, thank you.